Hi, I'm Ray from mummyof4.com. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are bringing you a week nine update on our home renovation project. And Zara's brought biscuits for daddy, haven't you? Yeah. Show everyone the biscuit. <laughs> so before we show everyone around, what do we say? If you're new here, welcome. Please. <laughs> Thank you, Zara. Should we show everyone around? Yeah. yeah. Right, into our bedroom and oh, what's this? We have the shell of a built-in wardrobe. That's exciting, if you isn't it? Put me down. If you if I put you down, you will touch wet paint and end up with wet paint all over your jumper. You will also probably touch all of these tools. Anyway, inside yeah. these cupboards, which actually are much bigger. Anything. No, I don't really trust you. You can stay on my hip. So inside this wardrobe, we're going to have like big Calyx shelves, which are the um, Ikea like box shelves that we've got in the house at the moment. And we're gonna have those either end and in the middle with rails in between them. So we're gonna have high rail up here, low rail down here, and shelving all across the top. So that will be loads and loads of space with those sliding doors across there. So that should be fantastic, shouldn't it? Let's go and have a look. You can see that we've got this tape stuff all across the doors because there is a lot of painting going on, so we mustn't touch anything. Um, so the bathroom, I think the bathroom's pretty much the same as we saw last week, isn't it? So we're still on the lookout. We have been looking, can't find one we like for a soap dispenser that attaches to the wall. I don't think it's worth the risk, darling, because there's wet paint everywhere. So not only will you get it on your clothes, but you'll also wreck the painting. There's not wet paint on the tiles. Right, there's not wet paint on the tiles. The tiles right, well, we, we don't need to do that. Anyway, do it. So we're having another one of these cabinets, and that's going that's over there in that. Oh, that's coming tomorrow, is it? Okay, that's cool. So do we want it higher or the same height? Oh, right, okay. So do we want it level with that one? Or one high, one low. I think I'm thinking one slightly higher, one slightly lower, and put. Oh, I don't know. Um, oh, I don't know. Or maybe just level then. Oh, okay. I don't know. What do we think? What do we think about that? Should they be level or one slightly higher, one slightly lower? We'll have a think about that. Don't know the answer. Okay, and into Bella's room, past the very wet paint on the doors. Can we come into Bella's room, please? Yep. Excellent. In a second. <laughs> it's all happening, nothing stops. <laughs> right, there we go, we've got paint in here. So I'm told that this is an undercoat on the wall, so it's not the finished primer. colour, a primer. There we go, a primer on the walls. And we're, um, we are painting... Primer, primer on the wood. I'm oh, sorry, primer on the wood. What about on the walls? Yes. The right colour on it's the right colour, it's the first coat of the right colour. The first coat's the right colour. Now you can't really tell, but it's just a very, very slightly off-white with sort of a hint of grey in it. Um, the so we're now painting the door frame, or is that the architrave? I still don't know the answer. This is the door frame, that's architrave, that's door frame. Oh right. Door line, there we go. There we go. Given and then the this is new since last yeah. week because this is Bella's built-in wardrobe, which is huge. So it's wider and taller than the one she's got at the moment, which is great. Again, it's gonna have sliding doors, loads of storage space for clothes and toys. You can give them to Daddy, darling, but right now, Daddy has got his hands full of, you know, paint brushes. Right, Zara, let's go and have a look in your room. In here, we've got wet paint. So again, we can't put you down, sorry, baby. But we have got a nice, big, built-in wardrobe frame as well, ready for sliding doors. I know, darling, and sweetheart, I want to put you down because you are heavy, but I can't put you down because of all the wet paint. You can put me down on wet paint. I know. So this, obviously, when it's been painted and the walls have been painted, the internals of the wardrobe can be built, and then you can have wardrobe doors. Will that be nice? Then over here, your television, we're actually gonna run the wires from the television point there, and the TV's gonna go here, above a unit over here. And then we're gonna have bed, I think your bed's gonna go over there. Will you be able to see the TV from your bed? Yeah, should be able to. And then we're gonna have a big wall of calyx across here. Some oh, look. doors tomorrow. Oh, are they coming tomorrow? That's exciting. Just to see if Daddy has made the wardrobes the right size. Well, let's hope Daddy has made the wardrobes the right size, Something otherwise this could be 
Disaster. Slightly disastrous. Can you say disaster? Yeah. Can you? Can you say disaster? Yeah. Oh, good. Disaster. Oh. Oh. Ow. 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 Arm. Right. I can now use two hands. And oh, cram in arm. Okay, let's go and have a quick look in Will's room before we. We've got Andy painting in here. Excellent. It's really coming along, isn't it? Wow. And then we've got William's wardrobe here. So we, I thought originally we were going to put William's bed along the back there. A change of plan. It's going to come out kind of this way. And it was going to be a high bed, but then we did decide last week that wasn't going to work because of the window placement. So his bed is now going to come out along here. He can kind of get out either side of it. Then he's going to have a unit here. Actually, this the space here is much bigger than I thought it would be. I figured it would be about this much, but that's loads of space. So then maybe a desk here, unit, high shelves, not even sure. And then over here, William's TV will go up high and then either a unit or desk can go under there as well. We've actually got options in here. So I've got less space than I thought we'd have over there and more space here and here. So that'll all work out quite nicely. Now, if we go and have a look downstairs. Oh, now that wasn't in here last week, was it? Look in here. Last week's update, we had sun tiles on the, oh, and a magic light. Sun tiles on the wall and sun tiles on the floor. And that had been taken out, it's now been put back in. Look at this. We've got a space saving toilet and sink unit. Isn't that cool? Does it actually work? Can we try this water or will that make disaster? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Water even works. Hopefully that was all plumbed in properly. So it will. And look at this. A lovely shower. <gasps> so that is that is exciting because we do need to find um, a tall, thin unit to go up there for storage. Um, but this is really quite cool. Coming out of the bathroom, Dylan's room is still kind of you know a dumping ground, and yes, our Christmas tree is still in those bags over there. It's still not at the attic. But never mind, never mind. These lights really do. Oh, see, it does make a difference, doesn't it? I do think we need a big tall mirror for here. The options for along here are either a big tall mirror or lots of like really nice photo frames and things. But I figure we need something there. In here, oh, what are we doing in here? I see. Has he? Is that the one? Has he given you a biscuit? Yeah. Has he? Yeah. Now this is the room that you were saying the walls oh, yeah. need a lot of work. And you weren't joking, were you? Yeah, you this this does need I think TLC <laughs> of some description. Oh dear. You can send in your pink car in a moment, darling. We're gonna go get the big ones from school soon, but first we've just gotta finish showing up and around. So this will be either sofa over there or desk over there, and then the other one will be over there, sofa or desk. We need to measure to see how many boxes of Calyx we can fit to come out to here to make into a like a doorway here and sort of floor to ceiling storage here, and then across the back here for the washing machine, the laundry storage, and the big sliding doors. Still trying to persuade him to build an actual partition wall, but it's not going well. No. Okay, in here. So the television's going over here. When we were in Ikea, I saw those floating boxes that I really liked. I'm thinking some of those on that wall for some decorative plants and things. Not sure exactly what, but floating boxes up there somewhere. And then we still need to choose an L-shaped sofa for in here. I am loving this floor. Now, I don't know if you can see very well because it is literally covered in, you know, dirt and grime because of grime and things. But this is the sparkly, sparkly floor. This is where you need to look at it. Where do I need to look at it? Here. Here. Oh, you've cleaned a bit, have you? Yeah, can I walk on this? Am I allowed? Yeah. Can you see that? Oh, you can see it a bit more. Can you see that? It's like twinkly, twinkly, sparkly. I'm not sure if you can see that on camera. Let me know in the comments if you can see that. But this is all going to be transformed by the next time we see it. By next Tuesday, what are we hoping to see in here? An actual kitchen, because today I'm filming, it's Tuesday. Um, kitchen is coming in two days. The kitchen is coming in two days time. So in seven days time. We fit in Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So in seven days time, this empty room is gonna be an actual kitchen? That's flipping exciting, you know. 
I will be impressed. The question is, Guy, can he pull it off? Will there be an actual kitchen in this space that has been delivered in two days? So will he, ha in the space of five days, fit the whole kitchen? Let me know in the comments, place your bets now, I'm if we can pull it off. Down. And paint downstairs and get the carpet down. So what you're actually saying by next week, let's see what we're promising for next week. Well, two a bedrooms kitchen, and carpeted. two bedrooms carpeted, so that means they're painted and carpeted. Well, yeah, they've got to be painted if we can't. So we're expecting to see a lot of changes by next week. Seen a lot this week, haven't you? We have seen a lot this week, but I think this this next week that you're promising the biggest changes that we've seen so far. So do not forget to tune in next week. Okay. Well, and um, we'll see what everyone thinks whether you can actually pull it off. Okay. Let me know in the comments. On. The challenge is on. Okay. So Zara, I think we'd better go and um, fetch the others from school now. Oh, you're eating biscuits, Theo. Do you think we better go and get the others from school now? Yeah? Better get because if we don't let daddy get on with it, he's not gonna finish the day. No. Thank you so much for watching. If you've liked this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified when we post more videos. Uh, if you want to watch my latest video, it's just over here. And for more home renovation stuff, it's just down here. I'll see you guys soon. Say bye.